Welcome to DIY Solar Homestead. Happy holiday for all you veterans and me. But to remember all of those fallen soldiers throughout all time. So that's that's the holiday, not me. So today I'm playing in the garden and uh, we got this two days worth of stuff. Some of it's already planted. A lot of homesteaders are saying onion starts, the onions around the perimeter. So I got onion starts and I've got chives. A bunch of onions starters. So I put them all in there right now. I let them soak. Got a couple more chives. So I took it down to the root or to the to the base of the plant. Some of them a little bit deeper. Like that tomato right there, it's probably 13 bucks or so, but I took it down a little bit deeper than a, but it'll, it'll grow roots there anyway. Thanks for uh, gardening with James Pergioni. There's the MI Gardener, Green Dream Project, Justin Rhodes. There's a whole bunch more out there. So they're teaching me, this is my first garden outside. <laughs> I got uh, the indoor garden. It's going to come out here real soon. It rained on me earlier, and we got other projects like the fence. So I got the chicken fence. I got the, I gotta watch my step. I got the solar charger right there for the fence. I couldn't find the wire anywhere, but I started to unravel it. And you can see a bare wire in there. So now I know. Of course, I know the solar pretty good. <laughs> I got 13 more on the other side. So I got this wrapped up now. I know what to do. So all in, all in due time, it's just a lot of fence. So I'm thinking I'm going to double it around, keep the critters out, and to keep the chickens safe. I don't have chickens yet. But I got the dish for the water. And I got the the food dish and we got the wood chips I think I'm just gonna go get some soon put them in a kitty litter container and bring them home keep them indoors I don't have the light for it yet and then it started I'm on my way so it's in a nutshell real fast these guys didn't come and get their trees out yet. I'm getting the, the pool cleaned up. I'm about ready to get in there real soon. And uh, I gotta get that all sorted out. I might have a, a bigger chicken coop out there. I gotta get it all cleaned up. So, I know. I like to be on the computer a lot. Uh, that's how I learn everything that I'm learning for the last two years. Is, becoming a youtuber and watching everybody else's videos because you guys are teaching me everything so god bless all of you and if you need to if you want go ahead and look at all the other people that's commented and get to know the rest of the community on my side i'm not that big of a community but it's only been two years but i think i'll get stronger now that i'm planting outdoors we got the stuff going on the indoor garden's not doing too well. Sometimes I go four, five, six days without watering. But out here, like it rained today, so it's, I don't have to worry about it. Uh, well, I do today, because I gotta, I gotta get these guys watered down. So, just to let you all know, I'm, I'm started. Whew, it's gonna be beautiful. I gotta get the chicks soon to get them going. But I want the Easter egg basket. So I don't know the channel. Oh, Roots and Refuge. She is extremely intelligent. And she just, one of her daily videos was 25 minutes long. So, wow. That family has a lot going on. They've got a lot of knowledge going on. They've got a lot of years of experience. So it just takes a lot of time to sit there and watch all those videos and listen and learn. But I'll have it. I'll have it. Thank you everybody for supporting my channel. Alright.
chickens. <laughs> I want oh I want the Easter egg basket. So a lot of people have the same color eggs, all of them, and I don't want that. I like the I like the duck eggs, and some of the chicken eggs are small. Some of them are big. Some are blue, gray, yellow. So yeah, but I'm gonna start out with a few chicks and go from there because I got a I got a learning curve. Okay, and uh, we gotta get our fitness on. Not too bad for 54. <laughs> so um, it's definitely keeping me going out here. I've had a few breaks. <laughs> Gardening is tough work, ain't it? <laughs> but we're rolling, rolling with the punches. Every day makes a difference. All right, out here and have a nice sunny day. Oh yeah, get a little bit of sun, a little bit of overcast. We got to get out of the, the solar electronics here pretty soon. And this train coming. Have a nice sunny day.